We bought a map and circled every place we ever wanted to go. I got a thousand US dollars for aluminum cans. When you get in touch with why you want to do something, the what doesn't matter and the how will show up. I promise you. A dreampreneur is one who has the uncanny will, the unrelenting will to pursue and achieve their goals and dreams, despite their fears, obstacles, and opposition. I learned on this trip to do something new. Got my hand with his hand. Alive, free, happy on purpose, and, and true. When you go abroad, everything's in squiggly little lines. In Uganda, women do all the work. As in most of Asia, women build the homes and men tend to the cattle. What I really love and what I really get value from is doing a homestay, making a complete connection with a total stranger and being welcomed into their, into their home. I'm not reading a script. I don't, I don't have a script. Every presentation is a little different based on the energy that I feel. And this is city living in China. Here's a school bus in India. No, no, no. There is no... And I love the coffins for sale, right on the side of the street. And this is a restaurant that we went to a few times, and all the food was alive. You pick your own snake, which we ate. When I look at the slides, I know what I want to say. I can relive the experience being there. But a lot of it is just my emotions coming out. It's truly my heart speaking. These people have nothing and they're giving us everything just to have the company. Sometimes we don't even speak each other's language. It has nothing to do with travel. My mission and my message is to get people into action for whatever their specific goal or dream is for their life. People always ask me, you did some crazy things around the world. Were you scared? I was terrified. I learned on this trip that it's okay to be afraid. We all have a fear of something. We all have something that's holding us back. And I'm here to tell you that whatever you want is on the other side of that fear. I think she was an amazing speaker and she had some good experiences to share and I feel like she knows a lot. I thought that basically like she was awesome. I liked um, the, the way that she presented everything. I liked how she had a lot of interactive. The first person to hit me wins a prize. Let it go. Who's ready to let it go? Let your fear go. It was someone over there. A lot of the things she's advocating, I'm sort of doing, mm -hmm. but I'm rededicating my effort to, to really examine my dreams and see to it that I do something every day to affirm and achieve those goals. Any time I get the opportunity to touch lives and have people come up after and, and specifically tell me what they're going to do and what their dream was, that's a home run for me. And I had a few of those today.